Artistic swimming used to be called synchronised swimming until recently and it's basically a mix of gymnastics, dancing, cheerleading, swimming. When it comes to synchronisation, we count the music and we have something to do on every single count of the music. You have to have trust in your teammates that they're going to do the counts, they're going to do the right movements and that's how we become synchronised. I'm a bag designer, work at Crumpler. So with the Olympics, we use this as an opportunity to update the whole bag. So the new Viz 2.0 Lite is in the name. It's lighter, stronger, the wheels are better, so it's smoother. If it was competing in the Olympics, it would get a gold. It's really cool. It's very modern and I think that that's something that ties in really well with the Tokyo Games because it's a very modern Games. And I think it's really awesome that the top part is clear. I always hand sketch everything and then once I've sketched it all out I'm pretty happy with it. Then I'll put it into the computer. I find like a bunch of reference images on how I want the case to look and then I'll communicate with the factory. I just kind of looked at a bunch of stuff like fashion and then I also looked at previous Olympics, looked at some old 80s uniforms and it was, yeah, pretty fun. So when I received all my uniform and the Viz suitcase I was just overwhelmed. It felt like Christmas, opening everything up. Oh, look at this, look at this. And just opening all the little pockets and stuffing things inside. I felt like a little kid at Christmas. So we wanted to try and make it a bit of fun. So inside the bag, we've put in a sticker kit. So we made some cool stickers that they can personalise their cases with. So we've also included a, a, a laundry sack and we've all connected it all together. A wrapping thing that shows you how to use the bag. And then we also put some pretty high priority Australian to Japanese translations in there. All the things you need to know how to get a beer. How to say how's it going. It's a really big part of making it feel real and it's a big part of the presentation of yourself as a member of the Olympic team. It's really exciting. <laughs> So something um, people may not know about duets is that you have to have a, a psychic connection. Everything you have to do has to be really synchronised. Um, you don't even talk to each other. You can just you know, pack your suitcase up completely in sync and walk off and you, you just have that connection.